Hey everyone, welcome back on the channel. Welcome back to another HVSR 3.1.4 from generation video. Today we are taking a look at uh, Roadcraft. Uh, this game is a combination of SnowRunner and MudRunner but uh, with some new feature and upgrade like the game uh, have DLSS HVSR 3 upscalers. Uh, also have the frame generation but uh, one second let me show you that the frame generation is coupled with FSR 3 like uh, right now you can see the frame generation is unavailable. It's only available when you are using the FSR 3 frame generation. So yeah it, you cannot use any other upscaler along with it. We will decouple with uh, the mod. So we will update the upscaler from FSR 3 to FSR 3.1.4 uh, the game already has DLSS 4 and we will additionally install XCSS 2.0.1 now there is some additional step which is needed to make the mod work in game settings so before installing the mod you need to go to setting then go to video and make the display mode to borderless and set the resolution scaling to TAA only do not use the FSR 3 or the frame generation uh, just set it to TAA or your game will crash at a startup so after uh, setting this on uh, we will quit the game and after quitting we will be needing this zip roadcraft is 3.1.4 i'm gonna extract the zip on the desktop and copy everything from the folder to the installation directory also close msi after burner as it will uh, mess up with your hood fix then i'm gonna go to the installation directory which is here roadcraft after that uh, root bean pc where the roadcraft.exe is located i'm gonna paste the mod here now it's really simple and easy step as usual we will set up the optiscalar.bat double click on it select the dxgi as it's working fine for me for one after that amd intel user select one nvidia user select two i have nvidia so i'm selecting two press enter press any key to close this window now we will run optiscalar.ini and set up the fg type so here it is fg type is auto we will set to opti fg then click on file click on save now i'm telling again if you have msi afterburner and river tuner open up close it from the system tray or disable the overlay with your hotkey now i'll dive back in the game and i will show you how you can update the upscaler and how much fps we are getting with the mod waiting for sale to buy cheap pc hardware then wait no more get cosmic byte ADS wireless controller at just 999 rupees and Cosmic Byte Pandora TKL Mechanical Keyboard at just 11.99 rupees. All right, I am back inside the game, and game is running from hard disk, so you might see one or two stutter here and there. Uh, so in order to activate the frame generation, you're gonna go to the setting, then video, and if you have done everything correctly, uh, enabled HAGS hacks from the Windows graphics setting, you should now be able to use the dlss do not use the act activate the fsr3 game will crash so switch directly to dlss and press on apply you will not be able to use the frame generation from in here we will use the opti and then go to the game again press ins slash insert on the keyboard and this menu will open up now i will activate the optis overlay also at the top left corner and with that nvidia overlay too click on fg active and hot fix and you will be <laughs> greeted with frame generation with hood fix fps has now reached uh, around 100 from 60 65 to 100 yeah, 100 and 510 maybe without recording uh, if you want to check the debug you can check it by pressing ins slash the insert and click on the debug view you can check the right bottom corner is with the hood gameplay and center bottom one is without the code gameplay and it's totally working fine so yeah i hope uh, this video will help you guys if it helps you consider subscribing to the channel i'm bringing new mod video every day and if you want cheap games and everything join discord i'll see you guys in the next one so bye now